Um, we are back for the Constellation Horse fight. Oh, I Constellation know. Horse. Holy, holy shit. I know. Coolest horse ever. Oh, yes. I would ride him into the sun. Now, this mission has a twist. You have infinite power. For I always have infinite power. Well, yeah, but... I don't think it's cool. Well, you know. I don't think that's very cool at all because it's really nothing different than how it always is. So Agni and Udra is now maxed with double jump and the uppercut, or whatever it is named. And this I'm not is a fan of Agni. I'm not a huge fan of Rudra. I oh. think Rudra's kind of rude. Oh, it means the wind, though. So, window. well, the wind is kind of rude. Yeah, you're right. Guys, yeah, the wind is to the soul. By the way, when in Dill Trigger, your armor changes depending on the we on the weapon you have. Cool. With the gloves, you are, you, are, you are actually white and shiny, and I did not equip the gloves, so well. Doesn't really matter. I'm surprised they haven't gone full RPG with this game yet and had you, like, finding loot and different armor and shit. <laughs> like, upgrading your sword with, like, plus 10 to poison. I think that would probably make the game a little bit more marketable too. Maybe. And then add, of course, four-player co-op. So you play as like four different palette-shifted versions of Dante. Actually, there's like old Dante, new Dante, uh, Nero, and Virgil. And there you go. There's a party. <laughs> well, they're 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 gonna play dice games on boards. Any the games in them? They can play chess. Oh, you, you also did it right. In Dylan Sky Four, there's a board game. It's kind of lame. I thought the chess game was in a lot of them. The chess game, we yeah, not the. I, oh, I, the I actually game. said we. Oh my God, we we we. There is a but chess board game. Yeah, why don't you ever say we? Oui? Like, you're, you speak French as your first language, but you never accidentally say the most common French word ever. It's not the most common French word. What is the most common word? What, what, cheese? Probably le ou la. You know, la pucelle tactics. Now, explosion. Do 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 Find and do 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 my 80? M? Ah, oh, okay. We have nothing to talk about. Did... Do you miss <laughs> XCOM yet? Do you... No, miss... XCOM kinda got boring. I'm kinda glad it's over. Yeah, I must say that, but... Do you... Okay, do you miss the wonderful heroes that accompanied us throughout our journey? No, they're big chumps. I hate all of them. Wow. No, actually, I do. I really do. I love them all. Wow, it's. I'm sad bad. we didn't get a chance to uh, add in Kyle from Full Screen or from Full Screen from uh, Full Grown Gamer. It's another YouTube friend that I've made recently. But yeah, it's like we said. XCOM. We started XCOM like two months ago. <laughs> yeah, well, that was like right in the midst of all the madness. Actually, it wasn't that long. It was like one month. Just took a while to upload them. And yeah, we were kind of slow in getting episodes done. Mm -hmm. It wasn't like in Dark Souls where we had a backlog of about 30 episodes at one point. <laughs> <laughs> we just kept playing and playing and playing and I was uploading, or you were sending them over pretty slowly, so I was only getting a few every so often. I bet, seriously, can you die? Pretty please. 
you're like flying ev everywhere and stuff, but you, you, you're not dead yet. There you go, I love you. Yeah, yeah, Angela, your bird's amazing. Cool, go back to the forest. Why? Do you birds think it's in the forest? I don't know. <laughs> Pretty silly. But they do! It just seems like pointless backtracking in this sometimes. Yeah, like right now, you mean? Oh no. Yeah, like right now. That's why this game will not last 20 episodes, but only like 6 or 7. I don't mind Metroidvania style games when they like give you a new power because it feels like you're progressing as a character and you've like come up with a new way to traverse the environment and you want to go exploring and stuff. But this isn't so much about exploring; it's about like go from point A to point B, yeah. and go from point B back to point A to get to point C. It's not like you can go to point X in the middle of there somewhere. Oh. There's no X. I might die right here. Although point X sounds like a pretty sweet game, I would probably play that. Oh yes. You'll probably play something like Res. It'd be like an ambient music driven shooter with really surrealistic visuals and kind of like psychedelic. Maybe. Somebody go make point X, please, and uh, you have free reign to use the name all you want. This bastard rubbed a, ye a white orb instead of a green one, and I died as a result. Bastard, bastard in his white orb. <sighs> Bitches. Everywhere. I'm supposed to have 18 cases of life, but instead I have 12, and that's why I died. No. Also, I'm not jumping. I should jump. Jumping is great, man. Ma Mayo does it. Keep doing it. Ah, okay. Ah, I see. You know why they call uh, letters in typography uppercase and lowercase? No. Because in the olden days when they used to use printing presses, they would actually have these uh, oh. multi-tiered stands, and they would actually keep the, the uppercase letters in the uppercase. Cool. So it was uh, quite physically an exact description of the thing that they were doing. Nice. You're yeah, actually teaching me stuff. It's amazing. Yep, that was probably the only thing I learned in college about wow. typography. Really? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Bye. Yeah, that I was always like the fun fact. I think typography teachers said that to me like six different times at different points. Why is there six guys? What's... Is this necessary? Actually it is. Because they weren't able to make burgers with the usual five. So because they hire another one. I'm invincible and that's amazing. Seriously. You know. Cool. <laughs> no sucker this time. Apparently this was hurting him a lot. <laughs> wow, there's a there's a ball in his chest. It's I don't size know. Look, wait. Oh, it's too late now. There's these tiles that are like pointy coming out of both sides of that. Uh, the two ed ends of the bridge that met together, and yes. I don't understand how they were supposed to slide so they interconnected. It doesn't make any sense. It's it would have just cleaved each other off. Minecraft and Terraria uh, mechanisms, you know. Yeah. You Imagine know. if they made a Minecraft out of hexagons. Oh god. That sounds like a nightmare from hell. There he is. Space horse. Oh god. He's actually pretty fast and scary. He should be fast, he's a space horse. How's he gonna get to Mars if he goes as fast as a normal horse? I don't know. He can actually, um, let's see if he can do it. He can stop him. Oh, or not. That horse would win in a chariot race, because you see how big those things are on the side? They would just knock the wheels right off the other racers. Oh, he's down. Apparently. Looks like it. Oh, no, no, oh, missiles everywhere. Rockets and shit. Oh, please stop. 
I think the most fun I've ever had with a, like a horse in a video game is in uh, Red Dead Redemption. Oh. Because of all of the ridiculous glitches. That game just never gets old. Because it gets personal? No, it doesn't. No. Hey, you went through the floor. Yep. Oh, okay. Well, we're done with the tiny alleyway. Now we can fight in a bigger area. This looks like some horrible gimmick character that would have ended up in the new version of Twisted Metal. <laughs> wow. I don't even know what they would name him. Like, Horseman. Oh. And then in parentheses, you'd be like, of the apocalypse. Do, do, do. Also, Blue Fire. Yeah, Blue Fire is cool. I like it. Hell yeah. If you play enough of graphics editing programs, like, eventually you'll start to see everything inverted, and then you'll look like, yeah, just like that. It'll look like the horse is actually just on fire. Because this is the exact inverse of what the normal colors of fire yeah. would be. They actually make this on for process it's amazing! Why is he shooting red balls at you? It's... Blue balls. And missiles. Where are the mortars coming from? Good question. Oh god. Are those like some atomic road apples this horse has or something? Atomic stuff? Maybe, yeah. Atomic road apples. It makes sense, maybe. Do, 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 I guess they're coming out of the trolley thing. Ah, uh, bullshit. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, he actually hurts a lot. Right, he's doing this again. Because it worked so well the first time, Kung Fu. Well, he doesn't know what works and what doesn't. He doesn't adapt. He just has a script he follows. Ah. Red balls. Get off the balls. I'd rather have red balls than red rockets. Sword Master is a good uh, thing to have with the uh, Cabellion because of the pointy sword that you have. And you just keep yeah, I hear jumping that. and slashing his face, and he goes down, and you can try to damage him a bit. When he does that, and you are not slow just yet, get away. Get the fuck out. He's gonna spin, that pretty much it is uh, his um, most damaging ability. Oh, he's doing this now. Now he's pissed, apparently. Seems like all the bosses in this have glowing red eyes. Well, demons, you know, Capcom and demons think that. Yeah. You would think one of them would want to be like, hey, I don't, just to be original, like, because I'm the only one. Oh, look at my drill sword going in slow motion. And they, it actually got him too, it's great. <laughs> I'm so happy. A lot of stuff just happened there and it looked really cool, but I have no idea why. You're gonna see it in, in the video. It was actually pretty amazing, yes. Ah, oh, I missed him. I missed him! Oh, I know he died there. Let's not do that again. Thank god I can transform. Four, five, sword! Oh no. Oh no. Kung Fu! Yeah, this boss is a bit tedious, but he's fun. A nice boss. Also blue eyes, not red. What are you smoking? They were red before. No. They're, 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 they're glowing. I saw the light coming out of them. I know, I'm just trolling you. Fuck uh, you. Flint. He's dead, he explodes, you can do, amazing. Quicksilver! It's cool, but... no. Sadly, it, it's... Is that the horse's name? Quicksilver? I think, no. Uh, maybe. I don't know. I don't think I would bet on that horse. No, the the horse actually has a name on its let, let, let me check. There's actually a encyclopedia. On... There we go. See, all of the enemies have um names. The bosses too. Let me see. I like the art in those pictures. It looks like a comic book. There you go. Severus Agni Rudra, Heart of Leviathan, Nevan, Beowulf, Gerion. There you go. Oh, it was Beowulf? That's who that thing was? Yep. It's Beowulf. Gatekeeper uh -huh. sealed away by Sparta for 2,000 years, blah, 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 lore. You can read all of this on Google, whatever. Yeah. Uh, it's actually some interesting reads, some of them. 
That is our next target. Hit, hit, Hitman style. Virgil for about 10,000 bucks. <gasps> Ooh, dude. Uh oh, oh. Oh. Hell yeah. And that's how I roll. That's amazing. All right. On this mode, too, it's weird. I've actually not succeeded that much in my real gameplay. Well, you gotta go back and get all S's on all of them, right? Well, yeah, it's it's, it's my mission. I'm I'm over fifty percent now, by the way. And not just S's, but like triple S's. Oh yes, everywhere. No, nobody needs the gun. No, nobody needs you again. So, life, 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 life. And you need to get the puncher. We actually have it. No, we don't have it yet. I'm sorry. Right, the bus escapes. We don't. We do not have the gloves. The gloves are uh, the property of Virgil now, since he he killed the bus because he has a, a katana that kills stuff in one hit and not us. Well, that's not fair. I know. If we had that katana, this whole game would be pointless. Yeah, I guess. So maybe that's why he doesn't give it to us. They should let you unlock that mode, where you just play as Virgil with your infinite hit Hitana that just destroys the game. <laughs> like, if you beat the game on the hardest difficulty, it just unlocks that, and then you can just go through and crush everything. But I- I showed this already, it's done. Oh, that's what actually happens? Well, yeah, you just... play as Virgil, and it's like, yup do doop do doop doop shit Oh, so he actually does use that sword. I thought he would just use like your weapons because I didn't think they would engineer a new game mode out of it. No, no, no. It's a, it's not it's not a skin. It's a entirely new character. Although he's kind of limited, sadly. I mean, in his brain, he's kind of stupid. But like, wow. no, it's it's not fun to laugh at these people. It's actually not. So let's not do that. Why didn't they add co-op then? If they already have two working players with different move sets, it seems like it would have been natural. Actually, there is. That's not a joke. There is a doppelganger style when, uh, if you if you transform, a dude with a second controller can actually play with you. What? Yeah, wow. it's amazing. It doesn't work very well though. The camera just fucks you up. It eats you alive. There's a secret mission right there. Should we try to do it? It's pretty hard. You do all of the missions. You can fight. You have to fight two deaths pretty much at the same time. That's easy. <laughs> Fuck you. I'm going for it. Just watch out for the mini sides. They spiral all over the screen and bounce off the walls, you just gotta dodge them. That looks like spiders. You have to fight the spiders and then death? Yeah, spiders, then big spiders, and then death. Two deaths! Difficult. At the same time. It's retarded. Actually, if you leave one spider alive, um, you will be able to fight one death, one after the other, which is nice, but if not, then uh, you're fucked. Oh, okay. Hey, what's up? Mind if you go down? Thank you. No, you don't. No, you said, no, you don't. Ah, oh, there you go. You're big and fat and stupid. Go away. I love the look of Dante's sword. I'm pretty sure somebody's made a replica of it by now, right? Oh yes. Pretty sure. Gotta be. It has such a cool handle. What am I doing? I'm just wasting all of it on nothing. Which is a bad idea. Ah! Already. Too big mama. Awfully durable for spiders. I know. They're like make making noises their legs and stuff, off and you just be done. Ah, death. What's up? With two spiders. What? Oh, it's because of the difficulty. Damn it. Um, I don't know. I don't know how to do this. Actually, yeah, I'll focus on death. Of course. Nope. I only saw one death. There's going to be two. They they just. Since the spiders are there, there, there's a limit of maximum enemies. Oh, so you can use the spiders to your advantage. Right? Yeah, but they're really annoying too. So, like this. I thought you were gonna say it was like four kings, and like if you wait too long, more deaths just keep spawning or something. No, it's the game's not smart like this. <laughs> Remember four kings? That was fun. Oh, no, that it was great, man. Remember when you couldn't beat him and you like gave up on fighting him for about ten episodes? I killed one of the spiders. I'm stupid. Oops. Well, have a death. 
I'll try to lock this one and kill him. That's what can happen, though. I was all like, just, you know, oh. tanking, just wear your heavy armor, and you're like, nah, I'm just too scared to fight him. Well, I actually beat him in the more conventional way, so... Yeah. How about that? Yeah, you just leveled yourself to, like, 20 levels higher than you were supposed to be to fight him, and then it was easy. And? Ah! I'm scared. Okay, and... Oh, God. No! <laughs> Please go away! What's going on? Ah! They don't... They want you to stand still, that's what they want, so you can't give it to them. <laughs> you gotta keep moving. Pretend you're a shark. You can only breathe oh. when you move. Oh no, I'm dead. I'm done. I'm done. I will not be able to do this on this difficulty, it's way too crazy. You're way too crazy. You're crazy. What are you doing? How did you not beat that? Well... Anyone can beat that. You wanna play, maybe? Yeah. Okay. Play. Um. Play if you're so smart. It's not doing anything. Well, there you go. So shut up. And, and, and now my computer's show. beeping at me. I think I broke my keyboard. <laughs> I wish. Anyway, you know where's the secret mission? Actually, this is nothing, I believe. Hell's Highway. No. Yeah. That's for later. That's the Brothers in Arms game. I played that. It was good. Really? Yeah, you gotta command your troops, man. You get them, you split them up into groups, and you send them over, and then you flank, and then you put down suppressing fire, and it's all crazy, and you, like, you care about your guys because it's World War II. Ain't that, um, Call of... No. I mean, StarCraft? What am I, what am I talking about? Yes. Yeah, the Zerg, man. I care about the Zerg a lot. They're actually pretty awesome, yes. Cool. You just develop such deep feelings for them because they're oh, like yes. insects made out of mucus and stuff. Yeah. No, it's the Brothers in Arms series. They made three of them, and uh, the last one was uh, for 360 PC and all that good stuff. Well, actually, I think all of them were for PC. That's a secret mission involving your guns. There's no way I can do it on this difficulty. So we move away. Oh, we go see Based Virgil. on the. Uh, the hit TV series from HBO, Band of Brothers. I think it's HBO. By the way, yes, you can skip all of that. I feel no remorse for doing so. And here is, I believe, a Nevan statue. Yeah, I, I'm not going to bother with it. This one is actually pretty hard, and it's going to take a while. I'd be really interested in seeing what goes on in these environments when things aren't going messed up. Like, what do these people do on a normal day? Ooh, I like the reversible coat, that's nice. It's got a sweet fire gradient inside. I'm jealous. Dante's, it, like, doesn't reverse like that. No. It just looks like a Twizzler. <laughs> okay. It's the same color and texture as a Twizzler, that candy, the licorice that you roll, you know, the twisty thing. Hmm. It looks like a plastic sheet. What do you want, bro? Dude! Party's over. Right. It looks like such crap boys, though. Mm. Damn it! Fuck your shield! Like, Damn it, shield! would be the, the head of the crew team, and they would, like, row boats on the weekend, but they'd mostly just want to get wasted. Yeah. They have do keg stands for practice. I love that there's a thing called a keg stand. That's just the coolest thing ever. Oh, okay. And that it happens so often that it needed a name. Like, it's not just that thing where you, you know, do a handstand on a keg. No, it's a keg stand. Like, it needed a name. Come on, Virgil, bring it on. So far, I'm winning. Big time. Pretty easy. Actually, this fight is easier than the other ones. Because of his gloves, he's so slow, you just... Uh. And if he actually gets you, 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 you just transform it and you cancel it out. That's it. Mm -hmm. Nope. Like it would be awesome is if, and this is like totally off the wall, but if they reimagined and re-released the Power Rangers as like a completely <laughs> like adult thing, 
Oh, it was I like mean, a battle between heaven and hell, and the Power Rangers had like demonic superpowers, and they were like Dante and a bunch of guys. He'd be the Red Ranger. Oh, of course. And instead of putties, you fought like horrible, you know, macabre demon abominations. Huh. And then make it, you know, all for like the 20 to 30 age crowd. I would watch the shit out of that. I would well, do that too, yeah. Ah. That's what the problem with marketing nowadays is nobody thinks about these things smart. Because all the people that are our age watched that shit when we were kids. And we would think, wow, what a ridiculous premise that was if they went and did it. But then we'd all be curious. I think I'm right. Maybe. I really do. I need to get in touch with like somebody that can make this happen. You cast the adult Power Rangers. It's Babs. Porno. It's Babs. Babs. <laughs> this was like bad, but super bad. Babs. 26 minutes. What do we do, coach? What do we do? Uh, we give him a break, because man, those last episodes were like an hour long. <laughs> Make it all skin size. That means that we're gonna have to uh, make three missions in the next one. I don't know if this is gonna work. It'll work. It'll so work though. It'll work. It's it's gonna be long though. It's gonna be a long episode. Well, we could just do a few less in that one too. It's not really a problem. Oh, okay, sure. Um, fine, you win. Thank you for watching this. This was um, uh, me and Nick. Well, him being uh, me. well, it was mostly us, yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, you know, it's, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm not. I'm Let's tired. Say we, made, we made cameos My in brain this one. Cannot take it anymore. And has been awake for 72 <laughs> hours. He's been scrubbing <laughs> a sewage tank, and he doesn't know what he's doing anymore. Actually, Forgive that's him. that's 25 hours. But all right. Give him Lord, he knows not what he does. Yeah. No, he hasn't been doing any of those things. But he has been staying awake for an awful long time, and we decided this would be great to do when you're delirious. <laughs> Because <laughs> all of our Let's Plays are more fun when nothing makes sense, right? I mean, do you maybe. agree? Say so. I, Let us I, know. I, I think so. Oh, you were talking to the people that are watching? Okay, we're done.